25-year-old. Tatis down the line from third. Fastball swung on. I feel Lowry is going to make the play in short right center. He's there on the rim of the outfield. Seth Brown. Swing and a miss. And Paddock picks up his first K of the Chapman. 0-2. Swing and a miss. And Chapman strikes out. Paddock with. And he went around. Chased the pitch that was way inside. That's the first strikeout for James Caprillion. 262, 11 homers. Strike three called outside corner, so he stayed with it. And now here's Caprillion. Forget that. Doesn't mean he can't hit. Got a fastball, line to have up, and he is up. And the pitch is back. Grisham near the wall. He's going to have makes the catch. Caprillion's going to come in and score. Jed Lowry up. Here it comes. Fastball, that stroke the other way. That's going to land for hit in front of Frazier in the score from third. Sean Murphy. And the ball is dropped down the first baseline. Fair ball. Scores. Lowry's going to turn on third and stopping lead as he faces Victor Caratini. Little cutter on the inside corner. Freezes Carrot. 30. There it is. Four straight. And Frazier. Much better lineup. Off the middle. And the throw. There you're down by one. Up the building. And the Padres are within one. Caps 3 2. Fastball swing and a miss. Kept it away, and he's gone on strikes. It's a half a dozen for Jay. Standing in. Line and caught by Hosmer at first base. And here is Adam Frazier. Frazier. That's him for a hit. His second the Padres uniform coming up. On the from third comes Frazier. Throw to third to be late. Padres. Oh. It's a right foul going back at the wall. Good home run for Manny Machado. DP. Frazier coming in on it. Mid in to make the catch for the first out. No advantage. He fires it back in. Loriano hits it hard to first. Hosmer's got it and he will win the race to the bag. 1 2 is grounded right side. Cronenworth to the backhand. Well, Jace Tangler. Murphy's going to hit. And that baby's gone. Murphy launches one hit. On top seven to fourth. Canna hits a flip. Frazier is under it. 100 is league average. She's 15% better into center field. And then he is a much better player over the left. Shadow. First inning just underway, and he struck him out. Tell you what, that's a that's a good repertoire. We talked a good contact hitter in Jake Cronenworth. Wow, waving at it. That's a big first inning for Frankie Montas. Bat for the Oakland A's. Oh, and a big swing and a miss. Musgrove strikes out also. And there goes Kana, swing and a miss. Two strikeouts for Joe Musgrove. In that first inning, the three-two. Hits that hard into left field. Plus, Lowry playing well for the A's is this to right field. See, and it's gone. It is tough. See it, Trent Grisham is up for the Padres here in the third inning. We're chatting with Mark Canna. Bunt put down. Manaya hustling. The throw pulled Olsen off the bag. And it's an infield single. So the eight and nine hitters both getting on base for the Padres here in the third. Bob Melvin keeps asking me, hey, you want me to get you out there on defense? Or are you sick of DH? And I said, no, it's the best job in all of sports. <laughs> you don't have to do anything. <laughs> Nothing in two on Fernando Tatis Jr. And Sean Manaya works. And he gets Tatis with that changeup. Another strikeout. That's five for Sean Manaya. What are you seeing from Sean Manaya from the dugout, Mark? And to see his velocity up a little bit. That's, that's good to see. Manny Machado into right field. Piscotti coming on. It'll drop in front of him. Profar will stop at third base, but the bases are loaded with only one out here in the top half of the third inning. Get on base. Osmer swings away to second. Lestella to short machine the relay not in time Profar comes in and scores and the Padres are on the board There's a 1-1 Nola in the air to center pretty well struck Loriano though is there at the track and that'll do up there fight for dear life one one to Olsen, and that's into right field, into the ship. Machado will try to spin a throw to first, and that pulled Hosmer off the bag, so Olsen is in safely. 3-2 to Grossman, and down on strikes he goes, foul tipping it into the glove of Nola. For Piscotti, Mark Hanna kind enough to join us. We appreciate the time, man, and best of luck the rest of the way. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks, man.
Fielder's choice to end the inning. Piscotty is down, and we head to the fourth, a 4-1 game. I came over in a trade from Tampa Bay with Tommy Pham, who's currently on the IF. Cronenworth hits it hard, but playable for Loreano to that career big league game. Three for 17 thus far. He ropes one into right, but right at Piscotty. It's part of a 1-2-3 inning work by Sean Manaya. Three and a half through. MLB.TV. The playoffs were to start today. These teams would both be in it. First pitch of the bottom of the fourth, and Vimael Machin will knock one into left field going the other way. Fifth career big league hit. On the ground to third, Machado to second, Cronenworth to first, that's a double play. And that'll end the fourth inning for the Athletics. Seven strikeouts combined against Arizona and Texas without a walk. First pitch swinging, Trent Grisham. Good play by Machine at short to retire the nine hitter. Order now for Manias. he deals 3-2. And misses two Tatis, and a two-out walk drawn by the 21-year-old. 2-1. Hugh back to Manaya. He'll backhand that. Get the out on Machado to close out the frame in the fifth. Myers with a hard hit ball into the gap in left center. That'll bound all the way to the wall. Loriano has got a good arm. Will fire away, but it's a stand up two bagger for Will Myers. Cronenworth. A roller up the middle, and neither Lestella nor Machine could get it. And the Padres will add another run. Myers comes in and scores. A little seeing-eye single past the infielders. There's Charles. Four percent of the time. Right side. Here comes Judge. Puts it away. The Pirates in only a second big league start. Grounded softly up the middle. Castro's there. Been going 21 home runs. Oh, thank you very much. Luis Ortiz passes. First there in attendance here at the ballpark. Ground ball of third. Hayes. He gets with the bases loaded, one out. High fly ball back Cabrera. He's on the track. He's at the wall. For an out there. And again, I mean, Cabrera has shown brilliant in the first four innings. High drive, it's on the track. He, the ball, Brewer is on third with. First run is a Yank. Yankees out of the infield in, and Harrison Bader, his first Yankee hit, and it's a 1 1 game. And here is Tribune. They're coming on Reynolds, slides, and he didn't, and the throw home is not in time. And we want 60. Outside, and he takes his walk, and the crowd boos. He wants to stretch it right there. You take your walk. Oh, what a pick by Cabrian Hayes to first. After Jason DeLay. Base hit. Don't delay. Bring up Jason DeLay. Second and one out. And that's through for a base hit. Burra. The throw is. It's a two runs. To lead off. And it's cannonball coming. Oh, up into that second deck. Number to deliver again. Brown ball and a base hit into left field. Pirate. Rodolfo Castro, the hitter. You know. The track. Near the wall. Clear the Pirates take an eight to three one. There it goes. That scoreboard as Aaron Judge is running around 27. And as I mentioned, when Ruth hit his 60th, he said 60. Yankees at this point. That way enough. See ya in a walk off fashion. Trent three. Castro down looking. One away. Let's see if they turn two. There's one, and there's two. Six, six, three, double play. No runs, no hits, no errors. One man left. High drive, right field, going back, Gamma locking up. See ya, a grand slam for Cabrera. Four nothing Yankees. What a start for the Yankees and Cabrera. His career grand slam, third home run of the year. The last two big hits for the Yankees. Stanton's grand slam last night. Cabrera's grand slam here in the first. Yankees up 4-0 real quick. 
Well, you throw enough sliders, sooner or later you're going to hang one. And Cabrera didn't catch up to the first fastball, but a hanging slider was right what he needed. We saw him make a pick last night. And he goes down looking. Swing and a miss. When the teams are winning. And that was a beautiful fastball, too, from Severino right on up the ladder. Yeah, he goes around. A little bit of a delay there as delay strikes out. Swing and a miss. And a fly ball to right. Judge will make the catch, sets up for a throw. Tag made and a sacrifice fly for Cabrian Hayes. Pirates are on the board. Ground ball. Grabbed there by Torres. Nice one, two, three inning for Severino and five strong coming off the IL. There's a base hit to left field. Judge will score. It's an RBI single for Torres. And the Yankees lead five to one. We talked about it last night and Clayver Torres, some of his better swings, and this is kind of an awkward swing, but he doesn't try to do too much, is comes with two strikes. And right here, he stays through the ball a little bit longer, even out in front, gives himself an opportunity. Another hanging slider right there. Another run for the Yankees. A sure sign that they were off to the races. That one's driven into right center field. It is a base hit. It splits the outfielders and it goes to the wall. Torres rounds third. He'll score easily. It's an RBI double for Donaldson. And the Yankees lead six to one. And again, uh, Josh Donaldson has really improved the last couple weeks as far as staying through the ball a little bit longer. This ball up in the strike zone. And that's going to get down into left center field. And heading toward third base is Gamble, and the ball is cut off, so Hayes has two RBIs. On the other side of 161st and River, that one's driven out to right field and deep. Gamble turns, yes! See ya! A home run for Torres! It's 7 2 Yanks! Line drive, it's a base hit to left center field. Donaldson will score easily. Stanton will go to third. It's a double for Cabrera. And it's 8-2 Yankees. Ripped and a base hit through the left side. Stanton scores. Cabrera scores. Bader's going for two. He's in there with a two-run double. It is 10-2 Yankees. Aaron Judge has got the helmet on, but Harrison Bader, instant impact to the Yankees. High energy guy. Trevino rips one fair down the left field line and into the corner. Bader will score. Trevino with an RBI double. High fly ball, deep left. Sawinski back, turning, looking, see ya. A two home run inning. For Glaber Torres, a three-run shot, and it's 14 to two. Well, this should do it. Ground ball to Torres, and the Yankees win 14 to two. And Peralta gets him looking. Back. Oh, a little quick pitch right there. Mm. <laughs> oh, one Peralta pitch for the clock. <laughs> Oh, wow. It's up performance enhancing drugs and keep Ryan Hayes. Greg is doing his part. That's neat to see and, uh, and, and send a great message to the youth. Play clean. That uh, long time publication and uh, he spent of course a number of years as a Pirates back out there. After he got the last out of the second Pirates had Mitch Keller face Aaron Hick. I don't think we'll see Keller back out there. Well, you don't see that every day, bro. No, you don't. Joe, and you were doing a heck of a job. It's Brian Hayes. Nope, out is recorded, but Hayes goes ahead and follows through just where a bigger glove than the middle than the than the middle infield guys. Usually the middle infield guys are wearing anywhere between an inch or half an inch. It makes the biggest difference. But sometimes like that, the gloves can be so big that some balls that are gonna get through that 
that shouldn't get through. You know what I mean? You're going to have to hit a lot, a lot of balls. Samanego, 24 year old from. But he walks Peraza. And he's quickly out in front of Ortega. Nice work. The rookie Tyler Semenenko.